Welcome to Insider Medicine In-Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma. Regular use of ibuprofen, a pain and inflammation reducing drug known under several trade names including Advil and Motrin, has been linked with the reduced risk of developing Parkinson's disease, according to research published online ahead of print in Neurology. Here is some information about Parkinson's disease. It is a neurological condition affecting brain cells involved in voluntary movement. Key symptoms include tremor, stiffness, slowed movement and impaired balance and coordination. The condition gained notoriety when the actor Michael J. Fox developed it in his 30s. Researchers from the Harvard School of Public Health collected data on nearly 99,000 women and more than 37,000 men who were participants in two separate long-term studies. The participants collected questionnaires that included information about their use of ibuprofen as well as other pain-reducing medications such as Tylenol, aspirin, and other drugs from the same class of medication known as non-steroidal anti-inflammatories or NSAIDs. After six years of follow-up, nearly 300 of the participants developed Parkinson's disease. Those who took ibuprofen two or more times per week were more than one-third less likely to develop the condition than those who took aspirin, Tylenol, or other NSAIDs. The investigators speculate that ibuprofen may have a unique effect that protects brain cells. While today's research is intriguing in its suggestion that ibuprofen may slow or prevent the development of Parkinson's disease, it is too soon to try taking the drug for this purpose. Additional research is required to confirm these effects. For Insider Medicine In-Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.